which is in progress. 22,344 schools are 280 other educational institutions under this initiative with an estimated total cost of rupees 16,021.67 crores. <laughs> to make sure that poverty of the parents does not come in the way of educating their children, my government has supported 44.49 lakh mothers in sending their 84 lakh children to schools under Jagananna Amma Odi's program. My, my, my government has so far spent 19,617.60 crores under this initiative. Out of the amount of rupees 15,000 being given annually to each mother, rupees 1,000 is earmarked for toilet maintenance fund and another rupees 1,000 for school maintenance fund, which is released directly to the parents' committees in the government schools. Digital learning has been the cornerstone of educational reforms in the state with an aim to making students from socially deprived backgrounds globally competitive. My government has distributed 5.2 lakh tabs worth rupees 690 crores. The tabs are preloaded with Baiju's content and they have been distributed to 4.60 lakh students of 8th class and 60,000 teachers of government and aided schools free of cost. To further bolster up our efforts in this direction, we are planning to introduce interactive flat panels from classes 6 and above. The panels are planned to, inst to be installed in 30,213 classrooms in 5,800 schools with an aim to minimize the school dropouts and to improve gross enrollment ratio. My government has distributed student kits well before reopening of the schools under Jagananna Vidya Kanuka. These kits consist of all the required textbooks, uniforms, shoes, etc. required for the students. My government has spent rupees 2,368 crores since 2021, benefiting 47.4 lakh students of classes 1 to 10 in all the government and other government-aided schools in the state. The government has recognized the importance of nutrition for the healthy future of the children. To address the issue of malnutrition amongst children, the revamped midday meal program with additional nutritious food items in the menu in the name of Jagananna Goru Mudda is being implemented in the state for the children of classes 1 to 10 covering 43.26 lakh children. The amount incurred so far on this program by my government is 3, rupees 3,239 crores. Realizing the importance value attached globally for English in the modern times and to equip our students for 21st century skill demands, my government is actively working to provide quality English medium education to all and thereby fulfill the aspirations of the parents from poorer sections. Bilingual textbooks, English labs have been introduced to achieve this aim. My government has implemented Several curricular reforms from the academic year 2020-21 with a greater focus on foundational learning and numeracy. The textbooks from classes 1 to 7 have been redesigned with greater focus on an activity-based curriculum. Affiliation of government schools to CBSC and the capacity building of teachers are some of the other key reforms initiated. Keeping in view of the affiliation of all government schools to CBSC, the textbooks for class 8 have been adopted from NCERT and customized with local content and printed in bilingual both 
in telugu and english sorry i have some throat irritation i'm sorry ha huh? to ensure that all the students passing out of high schools continue their education and don't drop out my government has decided to establish at least two junior colleges per mandal across the state out of which one shall be exclusive exclusively for girls my government is giving utmost importance to higher education andhra pradesh is the only state in the country to take complete responsibility for providing higher education to 100% of its eligible students free of cost without any financial burden on their families the government has initiated path path breaking reforms to transform the youth of the state into enlightened and employable global citizens ready to tackle future global challenges with a view to ensuring that higher education is accessible even to children of disadvantaged sections my government is reimbursing total fees under jagananna vidya dinena under the scheme the amount is transferred directly on a quarterly basis into the accounts of such mothers whose children pursue iti polytechnic degree engineering b pharmacy and other courses so far rupees 9249 crores have been reimbursed to 24.75 lakh beneficiaries through jagananna vasati divena we are providing allowance up to rupees 20000 for hostel and mess charges under the scheme amount is credited dire directly into the accounts of mothers whose children are pursuing higher education so far an amount of rupees 3366 crores have be, has been dispersed to 18.77 lakh students under the scheme effective implementation of equitable and inclusive schemes like jagananna vidya divena and jagananna vasati divena has resulted in significant improvements in gross enrollment ratio in andhra pradesh the government has also established new higher educational institutions such as tribal engineering college at kurupam jntu gurajada at vijayanagaram andhra kesari university at ongol 